start. Hello guys, today I'm going to read you happy birthday, thank you. Happy birthday, thank you. The nice icy land was crackling with busyness. For weeks, goodly, lovely, angel, neatly and perfect had been planning a perfect party for Tacky. The penguin's birthday, there was a whole lot of baking and wrapping and whispering going on. Of, of course, they made birthday cards, but since Tacky was an odd bird with an odd way of counting in only... It I mean it only made sense that he had told them odd things about how old he was. The day before the perfect party, the penguins went through their plan book, cards check, song check, presents, present check, fishy ice cream check, cake check, surprise entertainment. Check. Everything. Everything's perfect. Declared per perfect. This com confused his com companion. For as far as they knew, perfect was perfect. But never mind. They were ready to surprise Taki with a perfect birthday party. So the next morning. Oh, Tacky, they called. Tacky didn't seem to hear them. He had invented a wonderful flap waddly dance and was quite busy flipping about in his own little world. Three steps left and three steps right. Do it on your Tippy whip to get some height. Flap your flippers like you're gonna take flight. Stomp three times and say all right. Three steps left and tacky. Tacky pause in mid flap world. What happened? Surprise the penguin. Chores. Happy birthday for me. Tacky was thrilled as he beheld the beautiful cards they offered him and more thrilled when they burst into the birthday song. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. It's your own special hatch day. Happy birthday to you. Then they led him to the present. Well, Bird Tacky, what is it? It's a er, dinner jacket. Dinner jacket? Should I eat it? No. At the moment, they go. Well, thanks. Thank you. Hey, ribbons for everyone. Is this penguin decoration in our perfect party plan book? The companions wondered as they stumbled on the I mean stumbled onto the refreshment table, but they were too polite to ask. Way cool exponent aim tacky. He took a cone filled with fishy ice cream and plopped it down on his head. Looky, a birthday had a birthday hat, echoed his companions, thinking definitely not in our perfect party plan book. But there... There, they must get on with the festive days. On came the cake. When the candles had been blown out, goodly asked Tacky, Will you please pass the cake? 
you betcha, Chirp Tacky he did a Tiffinity forward pastor. Perfect. You, you lantern led to lovely. You flipped the cake to Angel. The spiral to Nisi, who tossed it to Goodly. Who wasn't very athletic and dropped it whoop, oops as they nimbled the mushy cake the companions wondered how imperfect can a perfect party get they were soon to find out it was time for a perfect ending the surprise entertainment this was going to be the crown jewel of their party. Absolutely. Goodly, lovely, angel, neatly, and perfect had outdone themselves. For they had brought in Twinkle Webs the Dance Queen all the way from Iglusavi. And there she was. Wow. Twinkle Webs announced. I then to perform for you a Dizar piece from Sun Frozen Body of Water. Gracefully, and she floated this way, that, that way, and the other way, charming her ad audience this way, that way, the other way, and then the wrong way. Gasp, 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 goodly, lovely, angel, neatly, and perfect. Nice landing, claimed Tacky. And Twinkleweb, who was not only the dance queen, but a first rate drama queen, wailed. Mine, Webby, my beautiful, left. Webby and injured. I shall never deze again. My creator is captured. I shall die right here. Like now, Twinkle Webs closed her eyes. How imperfect! Goodly looked at Lovely, who looked at Angel and looked at neatly and looked at perfect who looked back at goodly oh dear what to do now the hovered over twinkle webs ringing their flippers and coming o coming over with his his icicles what a dreadful end for their perfect party. They were ready to tear their hair. If only they had any. Meanwhile, Tacky, who had been distracted by some cake, comes on his foot and does he did not realize it. The seriousness of the situation hooped up, hopped up on the stage. Hey, what to see a crummy dance? Get it comes crummy, he he. And with that, he began his flap waddle dance. Three steps left and three steps right. Twinkle webs open one eye. Do it on your tippy webs to get some height. Twinkle webs open the other eye. Flap your flippers like you're gonna take flight. No twinkle webs has up on her feet stop three times and say all right 
All right, explained Twinkle Red. Those beautiful left webby suddenly felt much better. She hopped back on the stage. The dean, the beautiful these peas. I want it. I must heave it. Show me. He, she followed Tacky step for step, and by the third time, Tacky's five party penguins had recovered and hopped to the stage. Now, now everybody joined it. Three steps left and three steps right. Do it on your tippy webs to get some height. Flap your flippers like you're gonna take flight. Stop three times and say all right. Hooray! It was the perfect party after all. Twinkle Web gave Tacky an autograph and a big keys. Then everybody hugged Tacky. Tacky was an odd birdie, but bird, but a nice bird to have around and a perfect bird to have at a party. The end.